Welcome to our news updates. Minority leader Mitch McConnell, Republican Kentucky, has announced his resignation from the role of the highest-ranking Republican in the Senate, marking the close of his unprecedented 17-year tenure in this leadership position amid speculations about his health and advancing age. McConnell, aged 82, shared his decision to step down during a Senate address on Wednesday, expressing his desire to embark on the next phase of his life. He indicated that his departure would occur following the election of a new leader by his party in November. Although he plans to continue serving in the Senate beyond that point, his current term concludes in January 2027, and his intentions regarding re-election remain uncertain. Elected to the Senate in 1985, McConnell held the position of the GOP's minority leader from 2007 to 2015, ascended to majority leader with the Republican takeover of the Senate in 2015, and reverted to minority leader after Democrats regained control in January 2021. As we continue please support us by clicking on the subscription button and turn on the notification bell for more updates. In his farewell speech on the Senate floor, McConnell, now the longest-serving Senate party leader in U.S. history, reflected on his nearly four decades in the Senate as the greatest honor of his life. He acknowledged the inevitable passage of time and the necessity for fresh leadership. Recently turning 82, McConnell has been under increased scrutiny due to health concerns, highlighted by episodes during press conferences last year where he momentarily became unresponsive. Despite the speculation, McConnell committed in September to fulfilling his Senate term. Subsequent medical evaluations did not link McConnell to any critical conditions such as a stroke, Parkinson's disease, or seizures, yet his health incidents, including previous falls that led to severe injuries, have raised concerns. Throughout his tenure, McConnell emerged as a key opponent to Democratic initiatives, notably attempting to limit President Barack Obama to one term, and blocking the Supreme Court nomination of Merrick Garland in 2016 arguing against such a nomination preceding a presidential election. However, he later facilitated the nomination of Amy Coney Barrett by President Trump under similar circumstances. McConnell has also navigated challenges within his party, particularly criticism from Donald Trump and divergence from the party line on significant issues, including infrastructure, support for Ukraine, and immigration legislation, the latter of which he eventually opposed. As speculation mounts over who will succeed McConnell as the Republican leader in the Senate, he confidently stated his intent to continue defying his detractors with the same vigor they've come to expect. Thanks for watching. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below.